Okay, so where you're going to hear the seventh chords the most frequently used is in classical and jazz. You'll notice I've given a lot of attention to the fully diminished seventh chord in this series because it's the one that we're least familiar with. But the half diminished chord has an exotic sound of its own. It was used quite a bit by, say, Debussy or Ravel. And the major seventh chord. We heard in a lot of new age pieces I've noticed, particularly from the 90s. And the minor seventh chord is usually used in a blues setting. That sort of thing. So each one of these has its own defining characteristic. 